Hey guys, Andrew Madrid here from ProLine Wraps. We've been getting a lot of questions on our Pro XP 4 seat build. A lot of people have been asking what parts we put on the car, so we're here to show you guys today. So starting with the front bumper here, uh, we decided to go with the Salt Industries front bumper. We like the style of it, and it also fits our Heretic lights that we chose for the front. With the suspension, we decided to go with HDR. We really like the style of their kit, the Elite kit, and it's really strong and it fits this build perfectly. For the tie rods, we went with the Salt Industries. We felt that it matched the HDR suspension as far as strength, so we really like that style. For the axles, we went Summers Brothers 300M axles. For the wheels, we didn't want to go with something just basic and cast. We wanted to go with something custom, so we called on Metal Effects for their Forge Hitman wheels, where they have two different color variations that go really well with the wrap. We wrapped the wheels up in BFG tires, these are the KR2s. For the doors, we didn't want to stick with the stock door, so we called on Polaris for these Polaris aluminum doors. We really liked the style of this door. It was low in the front and it raised up high in the back, and that really kept the look that we were going for for this vehicle. Another cool thing about these doors is it utilizes the stock frame, so that gives us the ability to run a stock door bag. So we called on Pro Armor for this door bag, and we really like this because there's a couple compartments here that you can put all the goodies in and it gives you some extra room for more storage. Moving on to the interior, we went with the PRP GT3 seat. We really like the style of this seat and also the fact that you can customize the actual seat to match any vehicle. And so we custom colored these seats to match this wrap as well as we went with suede on the interior so your back doesn't sweat while you're in the trail or riding and we really like this seat a lot. For communications, we went with Rugged Radio's new digital radio with their integrated intercom system. For the switch system, we didn't want to go with the stock Pro XP switch system here. We wanted to do something different and custom, so we called on S-Pod to go with their eight circuit switch panel. We really like this because there's no fuses and everything's integrated, so you can either go with a momentary switch or on and off switch. One of the questions that we get a lot of is whose cage and what style cage we went with. Uh, we called on DesertWorks to build us a one-off cage and it really fits the style of the build that we we're going for and it really makes the car. So this is their Adventure Series cage with roof rack. It integrates the Heretech pods here that we custom made for the build. And then there's also some side lighting and we mounted up our rugged radio antenna with our uh, buggy whip whip. Moving on to the back here, Desertwork supplied us with a spare tire mount. It's really cool because you can flip this up here and you still have storage in the back so you can put whatever you need back there and it's integrated with this light for cargo so you can still see everything that you're doing. In the trail or in the dunes, we have to have the best audio. So we called Rockford for their integrated sub. It hooks into this factory speaker system and we included these two Rockford speaker pods in the rear of the vehicle. And to finish off this build, we have a custom ProLine Wraps graphic kit that really sets us apart from the rest of the crowd. So that's our build breakdown on our Pro XP four seater. Thanks for watching. For more questions, send us a DM on Instagram and check out our website, ProLineWraps.com.